An upstate barber shop is giving veterans an opportunity to continue serving, but this time around, the battle is won with a pair of clippers. Our Rashad Williams takes us inside the Fort Barber Shop in Malden. All the way up. The red, white, and blue is in full rotation here at the Fort Barber Shop. When you walk in, you may notice a veteran discount and these decals because the place is not only black owned, but owned and staffed by veterans. We're no longer serving the country per se, but we're serving our community with these haircuts and with the, the chance to meet different and new people. PJ Riley served 13 years. I did four tours, Iraq, Afghanistan, Haiti and Africa. But the last stop after his service. All right, any questions from this? Presented a career that cut beyond the surface. Fort Eustis, Fort Jackson, uh, Fort Carson. Now I'm at the fort. I took off an army uniform and put on a fort uniform. From the front lines. If he wants me to go bigger, I'll go bigger. To a lineup, PJ says the shop has become a place of community and camaraderie for others like Air Force veteran Sylvia and Army veteran Brianna. The fact that all of us can come in here and be that still have that brother and sister, you know, bond and whatnot, and we have all different walks of life in here. Veterans go unnoticed a lot, so the fact that we are veterans and we can understand each other on another level and then we give back to our community just overall uh, amazing. Trading war stories, cutting hair, and giving back to its clients is how the fort continues a lifelong bond. Once a soldier, always a soldier. So that brotherhood kind of sticks with you, sisterhood kind of sticks with you. In Malden, Rashad Williams, WIFF News 4.